just found this. I found this and this is cool. Okay, bye. Alright guys, so today we are doing a review and I don't know if I'm gonna put this in the beginning of the video. I think so, it's separate. I don't know. But, uh, I was lucky enough, I went to a Target and I forgot that these were out still. So, yeah. Uh, we're gonna review the Attack Pack Dimorphodon. Which I am really excited because I really wanted this one. The man like is yeah, I wanted that one too. But yeah, the man like is I really wanted. But I mostly, well, I kind of wanted this one. But yeah, I like this a lot. It, the colors are nice. So here's all the packaging. Always staring at us. And yeah, here's the back of the box, like regularly. I don't know if I'm gonna get that echo. I don't think so. It's really bad. Here's the barcode if you want it. What? Yeah. This might be a short review. Anyways, let's open the box. Alright, so now I open it. Now here's the last time we're gonna look at the box. Oh, wait. It's gonna. Wait. There you go. Now this is gonna be the last time, so. Yeah. So, let's now look at the Dimorphodon. Before we review this, uh, let's go look in the card. So, yeah. Um, I don't know if you're able to see this. Uh, really clearly. I think so, that's better. Uh, I don't know. But as you can see, the Dimorphodon doesn't look anything like it, I don't know, maybe. But yeah, it has 5 strength, 7 speed, 4 intelligence, and 5 aggressive, yes. So yeah, that's the card. Well, we just want to get to the figure. So as you can see, it had the articulation, the jaw moves, wings could go 360, and the legs could move together. The tail doesn't, sadly. Just very soft plastic. And the wings, though. That's nice detailing up here. Like feathery, you see there. Ooh. All the bones. Ooh, the teeth. Teeth are nicely painted, and the mouth is bright pink. Okay, so if you do the facts up. Um, let me just. There you go, much better. Oh yeah, that's the thing with them. You could pose this one a lot. I just kept in this natural pose thing it was. So yeah. That metro sounds good. Before we ended up, so... We ended up, uh, I just want to do some comparisons at least. Like the wingspan is like... The same like the Tapijara. That's the same length. Yeah. It's pretty small. Also I got the more Nikes. Still pretty small. At least. But yeah. Oh wait. Let me just get the quits of this real quick. Alright, so here is the quits of with Dimetrodon. Yeah, it's nothing compared to it. It's so huge, the Quetzal. And very nice figure as well. For also, the Dimetrodon is a really good figure. I really like the paint scheme as well. Looks natural, at least. But I don't have no more Dimetrodons. This is my first one. I wish I had the original one to compare it with it. But, oh well. Dumb of me. 
But yeah, by much ado, I highly recommend you pick it. But if it's, oh jeez, as I was saying, by much ado, I highly, highly recommend you pick it up at least in your local Target or wherever you could find it. And then you could you could order it on Amazon. That's all I heard. If you can't find these, then order in Amazon or or wherever you can. But anyways, I highly recommend you pick this time it than up because it has decent articulation, decent decent paint scheme on it. But yeah, anyways, as I was saying. Anyways, that will be it for today, and I might upload soon again. Anyways. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next time. Next time. Next time. Okay. Bye. Also, subscribe and like while you're at it. Anyways, goodbye, and I'll see you guys in the next time. Goodbye.